Welcome to Lecture Online. Today we're going to talk about some calculus and in particular we're going to find the area underneath the curve. In this case the curve is given by the equation y equals x squared and we're trying to find the area underneath the curve from x equals 0 to x equals 4. So the, the good thing always to do here is to draw the curve first so you can kind of visually see what's going on. So drawing y equals x squared is relatively easy. It's a parabola, opens upward, the vertex is right at the origin like so. And we're trying to find the area underneath the curve from x equals 0, which is right here, to x equals 4, which is about right there. So 1, 2, 3, 4. There's the x-axis, there's the y-axis. So presumably, if we draw a line from the curve down to x equals 4, then this is the area that we're looking for. All right, how do we find that area? Well, we take the integral of that equation so we take the integral of x squared dx and we place the limits at x from x equals 0 to x equals 4 so we have a definite integral of the function and we integrate it from 0 to 4 lower limit and upper limit all right the integral of that is fairly straightforward that's x cubed over 3 and then we evaluate that from x equals 0 to x equals 4 so what we do then is we plug in the upper limit so we get 4 cubed divided by 3 minus when we plug in the lower limit which is 0 cubed divided by 3 and of course thus portion goes to 0 and so the area near the curve then becomes 4 cubed which is 64 divided by 3 and that's the area so fairly straightforward I'll show you a few more examples where we have to be careful about some other things but here in this case it's a very straightforward problem 